Hello everyone, it's Tony Gray with P3 Communications and uh, we're here at the Tetra World Congress in Dubai in 2012. I'm just discussing with some colleagues how much bigger this whole Congress is than it has been in past years and it continues to grow and it continues to improve and for P3 as a company working in Tetra and critical communications it's a very important showcase for everything that we do and what we are to our customers in critical communications and Tetra. Uh, many of you know that uh, one of our main claims to fame for the meantime is being the consultants to the uh, German Tetra project, uh, working for the German federal government, the BDBOS, on that project. But we're also involved in a number of other initiatives in critical communications. Uh, for example, I personally had the great honor very recently to be elected by my peers to chair a new group in the Tetra and Critical Communications Association which is called the Critical Communications Broadband Group. And what we in P3 and what I personally are bringing to that whole debate is first of all our complete independence and secondly our great understanding of the technologies and the user requirements in these new broadband areas. So in the CCBG, uh, another four-letter acronym to play with, we're working to try to harmonize globally the technology and the spectrum and the applications that will be made available to critical communications users of broadband. The way we're planning to do that is in multiple collaborations. So, for example, we've already made close contact and are working very closely with uh, the American counterparts who've been very successful in this area already and have uh, achieved 20 megahertz of spectrum and 7 billion US dollars of uh, investment to start to roll out a nationwide uh, public safety mission critical broadband network. Um, so we would like very much to be able to follow along on their coattails for the rest of the world and the way we see that happening is through standardization. Uh, so we're also working closely with the 3GPP, uh, the standards body that's responsible for LTE. And LTE is becoming the de facto standard technology in this area. So one way or another, hopefully with uh, some involvement of myself as chairman and P3 as, as experts in the area, we can help to move the industry forward towards a broadband future for mission critical users. And it's a great delight to me to be here in Dubai and have the opportunity to speak to you all from the wonderful P3 stand with all the great things that we do on Showcase here. And I'm very grateful to my colleagues behind the camera giving me the chance to uh, tell you these things about what we are and what we're doing and wish everyone attending this year's Tetra World Congress or indeed next year's Critical Communications World incorporating Tetra World Congress uh, the very best of shows and the very best of luck with moving forward the Mission Critical Communications agenda on behalf of users around the world. Thank you so much for watching.